Hey guys, it's Car Guy 11 Just a quick video today on my GR Supra. I've done several coding, Beamer code coding videos in the past, and there's a code out. Uh, it's actually been out for a while on the forums about approach and departure locking and unlocking. So if you go near your vehicle, the car will unlock for you. If you walk away, it'll lock for you. Funny enough, but all of my vehicles have it, including my Mach-E and my Corvette in the garage, and I have that deactivated on all of them. I don't like that feature. Um, you know, if I'm washing the car, I don't want the car locking if the key's out of it, and you have to keep the key out of it because otherwise the water will make it lock and unlock. So, and I go to car shows, walk around the vehicle. I don't want it constantly locking and unlocking. Well, there's actually a code you can do to just do the approach lighting. Like it just turned on because I'm near the vehicle. That is all I wanted. And that's what my Mach-E does. It just lights all the vehicles up until you touch the handle and then it'll unlock the vehicle. So super cool that, uh, with the help of uh, the guys on the forum, there is a setting and I'll show you here in this video uh, what you need to do um, and you could do it either way if you want it to unlock and unlock uh, you can do that but in my case I just wanted the light so but I'm going to approach the vehicle and I'll show you how it works. All right and this will only work in the dusk or night uh, in order for the lights to turn on. It's not going to work during the day but as you can see how far I am from the vehicle my key is in the pocket and I'm just going to start slowly approaching the vehicle. And there we go. I had to get pretty close to the vehicle in order for it to trigger. And all the vehicle lights are on, parking lights. So very cool, but the doors did not unlock. As you can see, the mirrors are still folded. All I do is put my hand, unlock the vehicle. And this will work with it locked or unlocked. So I'll leave it unlocked actually. The lights will stay on for 30 seconds. And the 30 second time is programmed into the settings of the vehicle. So again, I'll approach the vehicle with the doors unlocked and the lights come on. So very cool. Again, this is something I'd prefer instead of just locking and unlocking constantly when you're walking by the vehicle. So I will put screenshots and show you which options you need to select. All right, guys, let me show you the Beamer code settings you're going to need to do this mod. Uh, and of course, this is going to be in expert mode for Beamer code. And I do have prior videos showing how to do this in detail. If you want, I will put links below if you want to check those out. But basically, you're going to go into the body domain controller and you're going to do two different settings under key manager, the 3030 key manager. There's these two settings, CTK enable, you're gonna put that on active. And then CTK functions, this is where you choose whether you wanted to do the approach locking and unlocking or just the light like I have it set. So in my case, I selected light but if you want that locking, unlocking, you're gonna do this light, unlock, lock, pre-auth. And then if you do the lock and unlock, you will probably want to also enable in the head unit that menu option where I showed you can select if you want it to lock and unlock uh, with the checkbox in the head unit. And that's under the 3000 HMI and then CTK door lock, unlock, and then you're going to put that on active. So those are the settings. If you have any questions, please comment below. Okay, and here are the vehicle settings under my vehicle. Vehicle settings, doors and key, and, and down at the very bottom of this list, you will see those options if you want to program lock and unlock uh, approaching in and leaving the vehicle but anyway guys hope you enjoyed this quick little video please give it a thumbs up check out the other beamer code coding videos on the channel 
and of course other super videos on the channel. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.